Yo guys, what's going on? It's Mark here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Shield. We're on part number eight. Oh, there's a Pokeball here. Something we missed. So with no time to waste, we're just going to get right over into it. So we just got a Motostoke City. Get ready to take on the fire gym, but we have to sleep at this uh, Badoo Hotel once again. Um, it's my girlfriend. No, it's Marnie. Um, she wants she wants my help. She wants she wants to battle me probably. And Team Yell's just sitting up there in the back. You know her, her squad, her her cheerleaders that I should have. Team Yell needs to be for me. Oh God! All right, let's see. Flying is super effective on it. It's nice that they had the little handicap there for people like me. Even if you're switching Pokemon, it'll tell you what's the best option if you fought it before. I don't know what this is. What's more Pico? Oh, it's a little mouse. It's probably... Is it electric? I guess it's the only way to find out. It doesn't look electric, but... What is going on? Does it change typings, or...? I don't understand. It might be a normal type, though. Is it going to change again? No, no, it's under shock too. That's a cool Pokemon. I don't know what that is. Alright, let's... Let's end her career. Oh, I thought that'd do it. Probably could have kept Pancham out. I think Scrag is on the type also. But it's okay. This uh, Miracle Seeds is too good of a held item. Oh, we'll get some sleep. A little more Pika thing kind of cool. I don't know. I want to read more about it if I ever run across one and catch it. It's 9 o'clock at night and I'm drinking coffee.
But I do gotta go to work soon. Oh, we got Kaboo's lead card. I got two burn hills for the gym. Just something we might have to look, uh... <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't happen. I'm ready for that gym challenge, though. Did she heal me? Dreadnought's ready for it. Um, I do probably have some things in my bag that I can give to some of the squad. Okay, we got a uh, effects of trap from evolving. Switch off that fail. Um, multi-turn attacks. This will boost the ground type moves, which will help him prize money. Silk Scarf to boost the power of normal type moves, which right now Panchan has Slash, and I think that might be all we can do. But the ground type uh, Soft Sand might help, because we got Rock Tomb. So let's head over here now. Is this his gym? Because this is the same. It must be, because Hop is here. I just thought it'd be themed like the last two. You could definitely tell they were grass and water. So let's go in here. This looks like more of a Pokemon League setting type deal. Let's get into my uniform and take them on. This gym's mission is a little bit different, eh? Uh oh, there's wild Pokemon in here. You can catch or there's a trash can full of Pokeballs. It looks like over there. Catching Pokemon earn the most points. Earn five points to clear the gym's mission. In case you're running, you earn one point for defeating a Pokemon in the tall grass, or two points for catching a Pokemon. But you won't be alone. This comes other trainers will be joining you in your battles. Think about what your opponents might do and try to take the best action to rack up points. So we can put, just have a Vulpix? Can I attack my partner? Can we just snipe it like that? Oh no, you can't. I could, uh, <laughs> I could knock out my buddy. This is a weird gym challenge. A Litwick? I need that. Bro. Give me, give me. Do not. Ah. 
I think it's funny you can just defeat your partner like that. I want that Lilith though. Because I'll put uh, it in the party instead of my hit. Okay, she has a second. How many Pokemon does she have? Lilith, you will get in this ball. Do I, do I get to keep it? I do. I want to add this to my party, yeah. A fire ghost type. It's cool. Sizzle pod. Sizzle peed, sizzle pod, sizzle peed. Same thing, right? I'm sure we can find another one of those um, somewhere. Really? You and I could end both of your careers. My Dreadnought is just too good. So I could go ahead and catch the Vulpix again if I wanted to. Or the Litwick again. I get the Sizzle Peter now. Nah, I can just uh, defeat the ball pick one more time. I just wanted to have the Lovick in my party. If this doesn't kill it, I'll cap it, capture it, but. Yeah, I, I didn't think, think so. So we can go ahead and... Uh, heal up first. Alright, let's take on Kaboo. Are you gonna walk out some swag? Oh, we walk out together? He just looks pretty serious, pretty chill though. He's got that old guy swag. With his knee high socks. Oh, I got knee high socks too. I should something about him. Maybe that's the gym attire. Alright. This uh, stadium looks awesome. Kaboo wants to battle. He has a nine tails right off the bat. Oh yeah, he's gonna burn me. Hang in there, buddy. Should have taught this guy water pulse or something. That would have been way more useful.
One more of these should do it. I wonder what his, like, uh, Dynamax Pokemon is going to be. Arcanine. Okay. Oh, he's coming with the heat, dude. He's got nine tails and an Arcanine. Wow, I'm gonna flinch. Come on. Hang in there, don't flinch. And they're pretty strong. I am burned. Let's go ahead and Dynamax. Hopefully, because it'll last three turns. So we can knock this guy out in one turn. And then hopefully we get one or two turns for the next guy to knock out. And your Edmond just looks terrifying, that huge. faster than me still. I guess I'm am pretty huge. And just use agility. We'll use that move next time. There we got one more turn. Switch my Pokemon because I'm huge. What is this Pokemon? Oh, is this a uh, Sizzlepeed's uh, the ball form? Sizzlepaw, whatever. No, he's gonna go Dynamax, so I'm gonna be screwed. Might have been mine premature. There's fires in his eyes, did you guys notice that? Okay, that looks awesome big. Looks like the bug version of Rayquaza. And I'm gonna go... I'm gonna turn small here next turn. What is that move? That's sick. Okay, turn the one back down to a little baby. Am I gonna be faster than it? If I was playing to where I didn't want him to just die, I would have swapped him out, but... Uh, yeah. There it goes. Little oh, Panchan got it. I think it would be super cool though for gems. Especially to make the game a little bit more challenging. Like, just say this gym leader had three Pokemon, right? If you had to choose which three Pokemon to take in, that was a three out three battle. So just an all out Pokemon fight. I think that would be cool and an interesting feature. Or if they just made all the gym leaders have six Pokemon. That would be awesome too. I really want to see them bring back like the Battle Frontier. If they would bring back something like that. Into some future gens, because that was a that was a lot of 
There's a lot to do in Pokemon Emerald. That was probably like the top. It's probably the top of the line Pokemon game right there. Um, and then if they also, oh crap, I can't remember what it's called. Oh, the battle tents. Those are fun too. And the contests, all that stuff. There's just so much side stuff that you do. That would be really cool if they did like a aspect like that to this game where you can do it online with other people or uh, stuff like that. That would be fun for, you know, competitive stuff. That might be in here too, I don't know. I haven't bought Switch Online yet. Which I need to. I really want to do a, um, a surprise lock instead of a Nuzlocke now. Because I didn't know that they had the surprise trades on there until recently. Well, first we got to beat this game. And it might take a while. I'm, I'm going to guess like 20 to 30 hours to beat it at the rate I'm going. I was watching videos that said 40 hours, but I'm going to stop after the Elite Four. Um, I'll still play it, but that's where the uh, playthrough will stop. That way I can probably focus on, uh, you know, <laughs> maybe some Modern Warfare, but this has consumed so much of my time. I'm not really mad about it either. Alright, we gotta go find out some more Pokemon of the Wild Life area? Because I'm not gonna even be mad about that. You know, we wasted like half an hour in episode like two just sitting in the Wild Life area. Man, if there is a Tyranitar walking around, because I've seen it in the trailer, I will risk everything for it. There are many trainers that never managed to get through gym and they just give up on gym chums altogether. Hey, look! It's the trio. I don't... I don't know why many people can't get past Kaboo, because it wasn't that difficult. So this is kind of like the easy stage, now it's going to start picking up a beat, I feel like. Hammerlock is where the next gym is going to be, and I'm not sure... We gotta go through the wildlife area and get to Hammerlock. I'm not sure uh, what, gym, what gym type is up next. Ghost, Ice Dragon, uh, some other stuff. We'll be able to catch stronger Pokemon. Also, BD's here too, catching some Pokemon. I like how they make fun of Hop's Pokeball throwing, even though that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard of. This is the this is the rival gang right here. All right, BD, you and Hop go battle. I'm going to focus on catching some potentially cool. Pokemon, what? Little Swan, what are you doing here? There's an ice type just right here. A very strong looking Pillow Swan. Ah, crap. How strong are we talking? 36? Jesus Christ. If this was a Nuzlocke, if we could lock down someone this overpowered, it would be awesome. But it would be very risky. To do because they could just wipe our whole team. <laughs> I 
We might not be able to catch it. So, okay, let's just try and throw a Pokeball at it. If it's just ridiculous, because there, there ain't no way. Okay, I think it's too strong. You build up by this game, you can start the battle on your own to get the two players to help you out. I don't want to. North Lake. Her line. I don't want to, um. I'm gonna have to probably stick to the weaker Pokemon to catch. Some Perlines, Perlepers, there's a Gloom there. This one has some good stats because it's glowing yellow. Level 28 too. When they're growing, when they are glowing yellow, I can even talk. That means that one of their stats is maxed out, or they're all like pretty good, or something like that. I think it's where one stat is at least maxed out, so it's better than an average. So. So if I already had a Perlion, it would benefit me to go ahead and catch this one too, just because it has better stats. So it's just kind of an alternate, alternative option to breeding. Um, so we slap this Gloom real quick. Well, that might tear me up, dude. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah, we're gonna run. We're just gonna go to the next area and come back. Unless there's a Larvitar that pops up. We got some maneuvers, bro. Is this where we have to go? What the shit? That's so badly. Well, I need to know where I'm going. But there are so many cool Where am I going? We just have to try, right? Man, that would have been cool. I don't know where I'm going. This is a problem. There's a lot of cool Pokemon. I'd like to have one of those little scorpions. Uh, but 
I don't know where I'm going, and I'm not gonna spend an hour in here catching and then. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, well, there is a lot of things here that I would like to have. There's just a lot of cool Pokemon in here. Dude, I honestly don't know where I'm going. I'm gonna assume over here, but... Ah, oh, crap. Freaking Zigzagoon. I don't want this to be a full episode of me just driving around. Let's check out this house real quick, see what this is about. Pokemon eggs? Yeah, I like to leave. We can do, uh, there's two, uh, deals here? Man, that's awesome. Who should we leave here? Let's put Eevee in. Uh, just so. And... That's cool. You gonna give me an egg? Alright, let's get out of here. Probably gonna stop this episode uh, pretty soon. I don't. Is that where I'm going? Oh my god. Why can I not just have these things? I don't know where I'm going. PBH. Larvitar, where are you at, buddy? Oh, there's a Rhyhorn. Okay. This has to be the right way. I don't know where else I'm going. Okay, that has to be Corpus Cars of all right there. Wobbuffet. Don't know what that is. What is on me? I would love to just sit here and catch all day. But unfortunately, I can't Lunatone. Dreadnought, Knockdown. There's a bunch of different, um... We're in the Hamlock Hills, isn't it? Is it super strong? Flying, very strong. I think if it's very strong, I can't catch it. It wouldn't let me throw a Pokeball at that, uh... What were we fighting? I can't remember now. Can't remember. I can't remember. There's a bunch of different areas here, though. Alright, let's get in here. I'm going to check your gym badges, scratch badge, water badge, fire badge. It's confirmed to defeated three gyms, including the leader of the Moto Stoke. Wish you best of luck in your future battles. Yeah, please step out of my way. And here's BD. I doubt Hop will become his only natural. After such a humiliating defeat, there's no way you could look the champion in the eye. Dude, I beat you both. I've destroyed you both. Like, you can't talk crap on me. Uh, cinematics are kind of cool. I love this wildlife area. I want to come off screen and play around in there. 
And then I'll just come back with like a whole new different team. Alright, everyone's over level because I spent so much time there. This place looks sick. We got some new gear to look at. So which I might hit off screen to buy some clothes. But this place looks awesome. Was this the dragon gym? Because so far, I'm getting those vibes. Well, we're going to stop there, guys. I'm going to run into the Pokemon Center. Heal up. And then we will see you guys in the next part. But until then, guys, if you guys are enjoying, make sure to leave a like. Leave a like for that wildlife area. That, that place is badass. But until then, we'll see you guys later. Peace out. Have a good day.